Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. It's good to see you. We're looking at this book, uh, Expository Preaching by John MacArthur. Um, we're halfway through it, but we're just going to finish uh, on two videos now. And I would encourage you to get the book or to go on Grace to You or to Master Seminary. Type in Master Seminary John MacArthur or John MacArthur uh, Grace to You. And on those sites, you'll find information about expository preaching and um, that might encourage you to do expository preaching but we're looking at hermeneutics now uh, that's the science of interpretation so here's uh, some of MacArthur's steps on um, hermeneutics number one use the true text God's word as closely as you can responsibly determine it by con consulting specialists on textual criticism. Number two, employ the science of her hermeneutics with its interpretive principles. Number three, let these principles expose the meaning of the passage. Do an exegetical study of the text. As a person follows the prescribed rules in playing a game, exegete then is the application of hermeneutical principles to decide what a text says and means in its own historical, theological, contextual, literary and cultural setting. The meaning thus obtained will be in agreement with other uh, related scriptures. Priest, the exposition that follows from this process, make conspicuous the true and essential origin meaning and apply this meaning to the present needs of hearers in their own cultural situation. This is the historically recognized way to interpret and proclaim God's word. So there's quite a lot there to think about. Um, basically, um learn basically as much as you can about hermeneutics uh, a good place to go is dr bob hutley's um website uh it's a free bible dot, uh, commentary uh place and you just type in dr bob hutley hermeneutics course you'll find it and uh, that's a good course that will introduce you to hermeneutics and what I would call the historical grammatical method that is to say you get the text in its historical context uh, and that's what John MacArthur is all about alright just a little bit there for you to think about uh, we're going to finish on one last video on this series the whole point of the series is not to give you a an exhaustive account of expository preaching but just to whet your appetite about the reason of in expository preaching the history of it um, and for you then to go and do the research and think about it and practice it yourself as a preacher.